Lizelle, you are so beautiful. Keep doing your tutorials, girl, and please let me know what you use on your skin. Your skin is flawless. <laughs>
my mom saw that and she was like hey I have a green tree and I wanted a white tree this year so instead of me going out to buy a white tree how about we swap and she's been nagging me for the past couple of days because it's already December she wants to put her tree up she's been nagging me asking me to bring my tree over because she already gave me hers it's still in the back of my car I haven't even taken it out but she's been nagging me telling me that I have to bring my white tree over to her place to give to her so now i have the daunting task of taking all of these decorations off the tree so that is probably what i'm going to be doing right now i don't even know like i don't even know if her tree is suitable for my place like i don't know if it's going to fit to be honest sorry it's looking all dusty and gross but um this is what my mom stores her tree in and this is it right here it's green I gotta bring this inside it's kind of heavy and it's super dusty oh my goodness it's hot today you guys it's like 38 degrees or in the 90s if you do fahrenheit measurement but yeah i'm going to unbox this actually i should probably take the ornaments off this because we're going to keep our ornaments the only thing we are swapping are the trees so let's see how i do this a few moments later okay guys focus you're gonna focus or what all right there we go this is my tree here's the old one i still need to take it down but i don't think i'm gonna um properly pack it away because i know my mom wants to put her tree up like put this tree up probably tonight so i'm not gonna make it difficult for her I'll try and keep everything as like fluffed up as possible so she doesn't have to do as much work when she puts it up. But this is how the tree is looking. I think it looks really pretty, like the green with the white and the silver. The only thing that is bugging me so much right now are the lights. I have them clear, obviously, because on a white tree it worked. But on this, it's kind of looking messy and it's annoying me. But I feel like in the evenings when I have the tree on, which is like mainly when I put the tree on, is during the evenings, not really during the day. But yeah, I feel like it just, it looks weird to have that like clear. Even though it's clear, you can see it, you know? And it definitely goes with um, all this stuff that I have going on, like the green garland up the stairs. So yeah, that is... The tree. I feel like that suits this place really well. This tree doesn't suit this place. And also, look at this mess that I have to clean up. Yes, that came from this thing right here. So I need to vacuum this up because it is disgusting. I'm going to vacuum it up right now. But I just wanted to show you guys how the tree looks before I went and did that. So yeah. So I just finished putting my Christmas tree into the back of my car. I wanted to make it as easy as possible for my mom. Also for myself because I don't really want to spend time like putting it all away when I know it's going to be like Taken out and put together again probably tonight because I'm pretty sure that's what she wants to do this evening So I kind of took it apart As best I could without having to take each individual Branch off and like squish it up. So that's why my car looks like it's filled Because it is so I'm about to head over to my parents place but we have a casualty because I broke one of my mercury glass trees and I'm so sad about it. This actually came in a set of three and I remember in a video for Vlogmas a couple years ago, I broke the smallest one. So this was like the medium sized one. There was another smaller one and I accidentally broke it when I was taking the tree out. I wasn't watching where I was going and it fell on the ground and smashed. So I just spent like 15 minutes cleaning up this little hallway to make sure that there's no traces of glass left behind. Um, but yeah, it's so sad. I really like um, mercury glass. I think it's so pretty. So I'm pretty disappointed in myself that I broke that. But um, I'll put that away later. I just had to vacuum up all the little shards of glass that were left on the floor. And I picked up all the pieces that were too big to go into the vacuum cleaner. This is how my tree is looking, by the way. I like it. I feel like it needs, um, I need something to kind of like hide these, I don't know, maybe like burlap ribbon or something. Because that kind of would tie in with my flooring. As you can see, I have like that wooden look type of flooring. So I feel like burlap ribbon would look really pretty with that. Um, but I already put all the decorations on, 
So am I going to be bothered to go out and find some? Maybe not. I just don't like how you can really see the lights because it's not neat as well. I did this really quickly. I put the tree up and I put everything on it in like half an hour so it doesn't even look neat but i really feel like this suits my space so much more than the white tree so i'm happy that i swapped with my mum. i guess when the lights are out it doesn't look as noticeable like you can kind of see it but that's probably because that's all my eyes are focusing on but yeah that's okay i don't know i'll, I'll see how i feel about it in a day if it's really bugging me then I will do something about it, but for now, it's okay. Anyways, right now it is about to be 6 p.m. I actually have to wake up super early for work tomorrow, so I need to quickly head over to my parents' place, give my mom her tree. <laughs> I swear she's been bugging me about it for the past couple of days, and I've been slack, and I haven't taken it over to her because I've been busy with other things. Um, but yeah, I'm going to take the tree over. I'm not sure if I'm going to help her put it together because I don't know if I'll have enough time to do that this evening. Which I'd like to help her put it together. But um, yeah, for now, I'm just going to head over to my parents' place. As always, I'm running out of water. I feel like I've been drinking so much water lately because it's been so hot. But I can't leave the house without a bottle of water. I'm going to try and trick my mom and tell her that this is the tree. Like, this is it. Just this short thing and we'll see what she says. I'll tell her that that's the size of my tree. <laughs> Hi! I brought the tree. Is that all you got me? What do you mean? That's not? This is my tree, Mum! Shut up! Where's the rest? Where's the bottom part? The stand goes in the bottom. No, 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 your tree is taller than that. No, Mum. <laughs> It's cute though, right? Just like that size. No, but I didn't bring the rest because I couldn't fit it in my car, so I have to bring it another day. And a ship up. Go what? <laughs> she already knew. Oh, how am I gonna carry this? Okay, I'll do this like stand. And then I'll bring this part. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Oh, hi, Dad. I'm bringing you a tree. Did you read a message? Yes, I did. Okay, it is. This is it. You texted me about the tree. This is the tree. Oh, this is green. No, this is it. It was green. Come on, Mama. Help me. It's heavy. It I didn't want to take it fully apart because I know you're going to put it together like right now. It's green. That's cute, huh? How cute. Can I just say, your tree looks so cute in my house. I took a photo. Have you already made it? Yes. I made it this afternoon because you told me you're like stressing me. Bring me my tree, bring me my tree. Did I forget to ring the bottom? That's it, that's all I have in my car. There is a bottom. Oh shit. Mom. <laughs> Oh my goodness, I have to like climb into the back for this one. Put it all in a washing basket. I don't know if you guys can hear it, but there are a lot of um, birds here. Rainbow lorikeets. Especially in that tree right there, they all live over there. So if you can hear all the noise, that's what it is. Okay, this is the last of it. Mama, this is it. That's the last of your tree. Dad doesn't look too impressed. This is your tree. This is your tree now. Mum wanted the white. I swapped it. Mum swapped. You don't want white here? I'm off it for this year. You finished with white? For now. Just for now. You're just going to go back to the normal. Yeah, I'm going to be traditional. Do you like it? You see their tree that used to be? Oh that, that, my that god! Tree. Do you like it? Is it cute? That's, That's my tree! Yeah. It looks pretty cute with all those decorations. Yeah, huh? what is it? Mm -hmm. No. Mm -hmm. That looks good though. Mom, Dad already wrecked it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta take the selfie first. You're not allowed to touch the food until she takes the selfie, okay? Okay. Ciao. Nachos. What is it in the middle, mum? Beef? Is there meat underneath that? Yeah. Oh, okay. It's really good. Yeah. Show me. Mm. Yeah, she's in love with my tree. It's very good. 
Maybe that's all you should have done is kept your tree and gotten some silver and white ornaments. What do you mean? Yeah, maybe we should just swap a decoration. Yeah. You can have my red and you I can have your... Yeah, too late now. And your white. Oh, well, I'm gonna have the red one here anyway. Too late now. Yeah, that's really good. You like it? Okay. Cute. When did you get these, Mum? Did you have these last year? Yeah. I like the satin ones. They're pretty. They look good. How do they feel? Yeah, what, they're cute. What that we used last year. That one is a long time. Mum, you had the dramatic rainbow flashing lights last year. What are you talking about? Yeah, I know. I have to go home. Yeah, you can go home. Is that okay? You know how to do everything? Yeah. Still haven't fixed the fairy lights out on the patio. <sighs> this tree though, oh my goodness, there we go, cute, look at that cute tree, <laughs> I really like it you guys, the green looks so much better than the white in my opinion, I feel like a white tree only grows in a certain type of home and it just d did not suit this place at all, so I'm glad that I swapped with my mom. I feel like today is the first day where I actually feel like it's Christmas, I don't know about you guys but I just wasn't feeling the Christmas spirit this year, I guess. But after like going to my parents' place and seeing how excited my mom is to decorate her tree, I kind of felt like a little more festive in a way. Or I don't know, maybe it's just the green Christmas tree in the background that's giving me the festive vibes. But yeah, I just, I want to like sit in my living room and cozy up, curl up on the couch and watch some festive Christmas movies. I want you to comment down below and let me know what your favorite Christmas movie is. Mine? is of course Elf. I feel like everybody loves Elf, but I could watch that even when it's not Christmas. Like over and over again, it's the funniest movie. But I actually have to get ready to go to bed soon because it's already 7.30 and I gotta wake up super early. Before I do though, I just wanted to quickly touch on this again. I did talk in the beginning about my um, feature in Glamour magazine. And honestly, like I forgot to mention this in the very beginning of the vlog. But the amount of like love and support and like positivity that I've got from you guys and like people who follow me and people I know in real life as well, just like it makes me feel so happy. It just makes me feel so happy to know that people are genuinely happy for me. I know to some people they might not think of this as a big deal, but to have someone like Huda Katan recognize me and acknowledge me as a person and appreciate like what I do and my art and my work um it really it really does mean a lot to me and the fact that Glamour magazine reached out to me and picked me to be a part of it and to potentially show me to her means a lot to me as well so um yeah I can't express enough like how thankful I am so those of you guys who have been sending me like lovely messages and leave me comments on my Instagram. Um, yeah, it really means a lot. But yeah, I just, I can't, I have no words, honestly. I can't even get everything out that I'm feeling because it really means a lot to me. I'm going to say that over and over again. But yeah, I'm just so happy and I feel like this is like the perfect end to my year and it makes me feel more motivated to continue putting out content for you guys and to continue doing what I love doing. So yes, thank you to you guys for all of the love and support. As always, you guys give me nothing less and I appreciate you so much for it. Before I forget, let me, let me see who we can give comment of the day to because I feel like I've been forgetting to do this in my videos lately so so this one is from i don't know how to pronounce your username i'm sorry as always i'm gonna leave it right here but you said yes another vlog it's been a while lol please do more your house looks super cute i do plan to do more vlogs let me tell you guys i've got some exciting vlogs coming very soon, especially in the beginning of the year, 2019. I feel like I am going to end off the year really good. And I'm going to start off the new year really good. And I'm super excited about it. Next month is actually my birthday month, which is crazy to me. Next month is already 2019. Like, that's insane. We are already at the end of 2018. Less than a month away from it, in fact, because it is already the first week of December. Really, that sounds crazy when I say it out loud, but um, 
yeah man december we're already in december january is just a couple of weeks away and then it's my birthday i'm getting old <laughs> i didn't even want to think about it but yeah i definitely will be vlogging more and i'm excited for a lot of things you guys will find out about it in due time but for now i'm gonna say good night i hope you guys enjoyed the vlog if you did don't forget to give it a thumbs up and if you're still here watching and you're not yet subscribed i mean yes you could continue to come back all the time or you could subscribe to my channel and click the notification bell so that you get notified straight to your phone you get a little message that pops up to tell you that i've uploaded so then you don't miss any more videos that I post. As always, I hope you guys are having a fabulous week. And I'll talk to you in the comments. And I'll see you in my next video. She's my smile when feeling blue. She's my nice sleep when the day is through, yeah. Let me tell you what she needs to me. She's kind of like this. Kind of like the feeling after your first kiss. Except that every day she makes me feel like this. She's exactly what I need.